Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to Selenix Crypto. I hope you're all doing great and welcome to this new video on Beeble. Um, covered this quite a lot when it launched. Um, since the launch, I mean, it's, it's been fine and definitely in the last couple of days, it's been quite strong. Last three days, we gained some, some strong bullish momentum. You can see right now as well on the one hour time frame that we, were, we are slowly, um, or at least we were slowly forming some sort of a bullish market structure right here has been broken right now, so I just wanted to give you my thoughts on what, what, what the most likely scenario from here on out is. I think in general, Bebo has, has a very bright future once they roll out <clears throat> their application, once maybe social fi starts to, to rally a bit as a narrative. Um, I think there's a lot of potential right now. Right now, volume is down a bit, still very low market cap at $28 million. Um, but recently they did get some um, some big partnerships and my internet is very, very slow. Um, but yeah, I mean, with when that's that, this is not the biggest partnership. All right. But for example, with Animoca brand, uh, Animoca brands, this is a new investment because they have already received investments from them. Uh, but in general, they're, they're doing great. Now, it just depends on the product out role. But even if we don't get that, I mean, the, the backing it has from, for example, Animoca, but also DWF Labs, I think it's enough to facilitate a bull run at some point of time. For now, though, like I said, if we really zoom into the technicals, we had some strong momentum right here. Um, basically, until earlier this night, when we had a bit of a pullback across the markets, we had a lot of strong momentum. Um, you can see that we, we respected this band between the blue and the red line, which are the, the 28 and the 50 EMA. So we continued that. But what happened afterwards is that we broke down below that level. And with that, and with our bearish breakout below those, uh, below, below those lines, usually when it happens, that's a bit of a bearish confirmation. Now we also broke down below 25 cents, which is a psychological level. But you can also see if I, uh, if I put it on the chart right here, it's quite respected. So we broke down below that. And with that, I think right now, the two scenarios which we have to be aware of are that we will consolidate. So drop down towards 21 and 20 cents, and that will just uh, slowly consolidate in this level between 26, 25 and 20 cents. And that ultimately in these market circumstances, I would assume will break out and rally higher. All right. Um, or we can quickly reclaim that level, all right? Because this is the one hour time frame. I mean, the one hour time frame breakouts there on the four hour time frame, you could still very much uh, consider this to be some sort of a reversal, all right? So that you have, uh, let me quickly draw something for you, but that you have a consolidation right here, that you have one fake out and that that leads to a breakout and a continuation. So that's still possible, but it, it really depends. And that's what we'll have to see today. And that's something you'll have to monitor. I can also do... Uh, updates on it but that's that's up to you let me know if you would want to see that um, but the key thing to to wait for is some sort of confirmation if we can actually break back above in the next 24 maybe 36 hours break back above 25 and 26 cents i think we'll continue and um, next real price target is 30 cents then afterwards depending on how we react to that like can we keep the technical bullish market structure then eventually i think we can also start to fill fill this wick right here at like 33 and a half cents then ultimately, like 50 cents might be our price target, but that's uh, that's that's too far in the future. But those are my thoughts. Um, that's what I think you need to know. It's, it's a bit of a short video. Like I said, if we don't break above 25 cents um, and 26 cents in the next 24 to 30, 36 hours, then we'll just consolidate. And that's fine as well, because in these market circumstances, I, I think a consolidation like that will eventually lead to a bullish breakout either way. Uh, but that would mean it, it will take a bit longer. But those are my thoughts. That's what I think you need to know. If you do have any questions, let me know down in the comments. For now, thank you for watching. Take care and bye.